JustAZ.com Productions with JustAZ Aquatics DIY Moving Bed Aquarium Filter The moving bed or fluidized bed filter is simple to build and requires very little maintenance. It uses both mechanical and biological components to filter your tank's water. The filter sits inside the tank. It works only using an air pump and the media parts such as floss never need replacing. The filter is simply a container with holes on the bottom for water to be drawn up into the filter and holes at the top for water and air to escape. A sponge or a piece of foam is placed at the bottom. This is used to capture small bits of debris before they enter the filter. Inside the container is a biological media. Biowalls, K1 material, there's a lot of different medias on the market today to use. Over time, the beneficial bacteria will grow on this media. This will form the biological portion of the filter. Air is pumped into the chamber, which causes the media to move about. This movement of air and water over the media stimulates the bacterial growth. For the container, I use a juice bottle. This size will work well for a 10-gallon aquarium. If I was going to build this filter for a larger aquarium, say a 40 gallon, I would use a larger bottle, let's say a 2 liter soda bottle. Drill three holes in the sides, two for the suction cup and one for the airline. Drill several holes in the bottom of the bottle as well as several holes in the cap. Attach the suction cups to the side of the bottle. Next, we place the media inside the bottle. Fill it up about half to two thirds of the way full. place the cap. Next we take the airline tubing and place it in the bottle near the center of the bottle. We then take a sponge, carve out the inside, and place that on the bottom to filter and there we have our filter. As you can see the bio walls are moving around. Over time bacteria will grow on them. You never need to remove the filter from the tank. The only maintenance required is the occasional cleaning of the sponge. To do this you just take a little water from the tank the sponge and rinse it out in the tank water and then replace it. You never need to clean the bio media. Doing so would wash away the beneficial bacteria and the growth process would need to start all over again. Thanks for watching. Questions or comments? Put them in the comment section below and subscribe to our channel for more videos on the DIY lifestyle.